Hi, everybody. I'm, I'm Sergio Troncoso, and I'm here today to encourage all Isleta students, middle school and high school students, to join the Troncoso Reading Challenge. It's a uh, six prizes that we give for the students who read the most books from September 15th to December 8th. And uh, I fly in to give out these prizes at, uh, in December. So I'm very excited to have this reading challenge every year. And if any of you want to understand how I went from a kid in Isleta to a Harvard University and then to Yale University, where I teach, it all begins with reading. I love to read. And the, the place that really transformed me as a reader and as a student was the El Paso Public Library. I loved going there on the weekends and even after school to read my favorite books, uh, mysteries, exciting stories. And that's really how I became a writer. So please join us to join the Troncoso Reading Challenge for middle school students and high school students within the geographic area of the Sergio Troncoso Library. And um, there are three ways that you can join us. You can first visit the library at 9321 Alameda Avenue in El Paso, Texas, and talk to one of the librarians there, and they will help you register so that you can log your books and that you're reading during this time. Another way you can do it is by calling the library at 915-212-0453. Talk to a librarian there and say you want to join the Troncoso Reading Challenge, and they will tell you what to do next. And the final way you can join is online. You go to elpasolibrary.beanstack.org and register online so that you can log your books as you're reading them from September 15th to December 8th. I can't wait to meet all of you and the six prize winners that, that we give out every year and talk to you about um, reading, about writing, about going to college, and, and talking to your parents as well. I think it's important to encourage our community to read and to transform themselves as students and to develop their own voices so that they can be heard as citizens and as, as people who have something to say and something important to say to the rest of the world. So thank you very much. I look forward to seeing you in December.